So today, I'm going to show you how to make projectiles spawn on kills in Frosty the Editor for PvZ GDB2. First, open the gameplay folder. Scroll down. Open weapons. And I'm going to open engineer. Primary. Single click engineer grenade launcher. And open the weapon blueprint. Open the object. Scroll all the way down and you can see a spawn projectile on kill item here. Now scroll back up, single click kits, right click any kit, and select duplicate. I'm going to change the name to killed by engineer primary. Change the type, type in key, Select projectile key, and for organizational purposes, I'm going to save it in engineer's weapon folder. Assign that projectile key here. Open that asset. Right click it and select duplicate. And I'll change the name to engineer turret because I want engineer turrets to spawn whenever I kill a plant. We'll also change the type to projectile value. open the projectile value and assign the key to it. Next, right click the projectile key again, select duplicate, and I'm going to change this one's name to engineer turret spawn. And we'll change this one's type to it'll be a projectile blueprint. Assign the projectile blueprint here. Then open it. Change the flags to one. Go over to the search bar and type in imitator. Open AI, plant, imitator, single click imitator spawn weapon, and open any one of the projectiles. Copy the object and paste it to your projectile blueprint. Open that object. Open physics data and remove this asset reference. You'll also want to remove the mesh reference and the trail effect reference. After that, change the soldier and template to ones of your choice. For me, it'll be engineer turret. Once you finish that, scroll down under Soldiers, single click AI, and I'm going to open AI Plant Weed, open the object, scroll down to the bottom, add name to Projectile Spawn Array. and assign your projectile value asset to it. If 
finally, open the kits folder, single click bundling, and open the character shared bundle asset. Add a new item to the objects, open the objects, scroll all the way down, and assign your projectile blueprint to it as a projectile blueprint. Please be sure to save the project and I'll call it spawn turret on kill. And now that it's saved, we can launch the game to see if Vanquishing Weeds' engineer spawns turrets. Alright, let's go kill a weed. And a turret has spawned. So, that's pretty much it. Special thanks to the Conservatory for suggesting this video. Goodbye everyone, and stay safe.